Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, Music with Todd Ledbetter. Thank you so much. Hey, we got a uh, a new band for the channel. It's called Propagandy, not Propaganda from the 80s. Uh, this is Propagandy. They're kind of a harder metal type of a band from what I understand. Uh, but this was a recommendation from a local viewer and uh, actually a co-worker as well. So an ex-co-worker, I guess I should say. Um, so, uh, it's fun to have somebody in the grocery store say, Hey, you know, do this, do this song, recommend this song or uh, react to this song. I'm like, okay. <laughs> so, uh, you know, there's lots of different ways you can recommend. You can do it here on the, in the comments on Ko-Fi on Patreon or just in person. <laughs> so let's, uh, get started with this song. Uh, now this is, uh, propagandy, as I said, um, P-R-O-P-A-G-A-N-D-H-I. Well, you can see the spelling. Uh, the album is called uh, Supporting Cast, and we're actually going to be doing the title track, which is the second track on the album, Supporting ca uh, Casts. Uh, cast. And uh, it's a 12-song, 52-minute, 24-second uh, album, released in 2009. So let's get right on into it and see what uh, kind of metal we got going on here. Let's see what we can meddle in. I like the tone of that guitar. Peace over fire. 
sure i'm all clear here oh that was cool i like that pretty much i like that pr pretty well um really like the guitars it definitely sounded um you know 2000s ish you know uh when was this one released 2009 yeah for sure uh 2009 2011 12 you know eight uh, the guitar riffs were kind of right in that genre, but I liked the tone and I really liked them. I thought they were cool. Uh, I liked that acoustic guitar, whatever that kind of more mellow guitar sound was. was I liked the, the breakdown. Um, I thought the singer was good. I liked his voice. It was kind of singing and uh, almost like kind of talking in a way, you know, but it, I liked it a lot. Um, couldn't really hear the the bass very much the bass guitar wasn't doing anything in spectacular in there that I could really tell um, common for metal uh, to sort of suppress the bass guitar uh, certain types of metal to do that the drums were okay I'm not a huge fan of that jungle beat like that you know it's not my favorite thing um, and, and especially when they go when they're doing that and then they do that the, that roll you know, I, I just, those are the two things together, you know, you hear them all the time and I just don't like it. You know, it just found, it sounds like the roll is just like, like he's just like falling down across his drum toms. Um, not my favorite beat. Uh, you know, I would have been nice for him to break that up a little bit and to incorporate that into the song, but not have it the whole thing. Show a little more creativity there. Uh, in my personal view all in all i thought it was pretty good you know especially for the day and for the time it was put out um i'm just a real drum guy because i'm a bass player so i like so i don't get a lot of bass in this song and it's not my favorite kind of drum so you know i'm at a bit of a disadvantage fortunately i like the guitar and i like the singing and i like the song that was good it was pretty good propaganda i was gonna see real quick if i can figure out um where these guys are from just gonna take a quick peek on spotify and uh let's see huh i can't tell it doesn't say um there's no bio but they're playing around let's see uh edmonton uh calgary so they must be canadian vancouver yeah they're canadian because I, the next few uh gigs are in canada i bet let's see vancouver oh there's seattle portland san francisco san diego oh so they're coming out i don't know maybe they're maybe they're canadian um they're going to be playing september 24th um 
at the Telegram Ballroom in Los Angeles. That's, you know, I don't know where the Telegram Ballroom, but Los Angeles is about 60 miles away from where I'm at. I have no interest in going to Los Angeles, though, frankly, uh, for any reason. And uh, they're going to play with Torso and La Armada, uh, Armada. La Armada. So if you're familiar with Torso and La, uh, La Armada, they're playing with Propagandi in LA if you're around here so uh, very cool um, fun reaction fun recommendation I appreciate it and hope you guys uh, liked it let me know what you thought of propaganda if you're familiar with them oh yeah let's see I wanted to real quickly just see uh, what kind of what kind of uh, music they had how long is their history how long they've been around let's see so they have a 2021 release here uh, let's see it looks like it's a full album a lot of uh, a lot of uh, explicit language warnings on this album <laughs> and then uh, 1993 looks like their first uh, album how to clean everything uh, so they've been around since 93 very cool so quite a quite a bit so we were listening to uh, 2009 supporting cast so uh, they've got one, two, three, f four more albums. So interesting. I right, never heard of these guys. So it, nice to nice to have heard them and to hear them. Uh, good stuff. I liked it overall. I'd give it a, a B plus. You know, if I was going to rate it in a way, uh, definitely better than a lot of stuff out there. That um, I would enjoy this more than a lot of other stuff out there. So. Excellent. Excellent. So thank you so much for watching and listening. Um, once again, down in the comments, if you have any info to regarding propaganda, if, you, if you've seen them or if you're going to go see them, let me know about it. I'd love to hear about it and other opinions you might have on them. So uh, don't forget to subscribe and to like this video. It really helps out. Um, if you want to help out uh, the channel even more, you can go over to my Ko-Fi or pay, uh, not PayPal. You can go to PayPal if you want. People do that. Uh, Patreon, and you can recommend songs over there as well. Thanks again. We'll see you in the next video. See you down in the comments. You guys have a great day. Take care of each other. Bye-bye.